Hello there everybody, this is SpikeJ555 here today, and today we will be probably redoing the skeleton farm. And I did put an ender chest in here. I've got my backup pickaxe, and my enchanting stuff over there. Oh, here we go. I'm going to put these back in, because I'm not really using them right now. I, I was going to put it, put them on my sword but don't have the stuff to. Anyway, so I'm going to finish gathering supplies for the skeleton farm. Right now I'm just smelting up some stone for it. And I will be back with you guys momentarily. Okay, also, I was just at the mom farm I built. This guy's not looking at me. He's looking at the villagers. Um, that might be a problem. And the server is running a little slow for me right now. So. Yeah, I'm gonna finish. And I guess I'll see you guys at the mob farm. Okay, here we are. Not sure what that is. Okay. So, first order of business is we need to turn off that spawner. Spawner access. Let's get this thing shut off. We're going to be redesigning the spawner. Let's see. So one, two, three, four. So... I guess let's get started. So, j just for the time being, I'm going to get rid of all this water. Do so from up here. Oh. There we go. Okay. Got it. I should have my shovel on my brush. Anyway. Okay, so this is actually a design I learned from somebody else that apparently works a lot better than the one we were using. Okay, so, let's see, where do we want the two ends to be? Okay, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, so this wall is going to move that way one, and then, Okay, and then four. See, this ball is also going to move back. Hold on, let me see. Well, it doesn't hurt. But, um, hold on. I don't really want to redo this too much, but yeah, it won't hurt to move it back. Okay. So, I'll remodel the room and get back to you guys. Okay, so I've got a little more done. And, um, just, uh, giving out a shout-out to the person who I got this design from. Um, I was just browsing YouTube and saw the design. Um, his, I, um, his YouTube name is DataLess822. You want to look him up. And I will leave a link to the video where I got this idea in the description. 
Although I'm gonna be doing mine a quite a bit differently than he did his. It's just for the actual spawner room design I'm using what he used in that video. Okay, should we go? So now let's see. Where's the wire? It's like an iPod or Android game or something. Where's my water? Oops. Here we go. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay. So, oh no, 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 I don't want to go back down there. No, no, no. Okay. I, I might go just run back home and grab my Depth Strider shoes. Depth Strider, not Death Strider. A, a lot of people keep asking me what is Death Strider because they think that's what it is. It is D-E-P-T-H, not D-E-A-T-H. Depth, like the depth of the ocean. Not death, like you are going to die. No, it is death. Okay. Now, I just want to see what this one is. Huh. I should really go down right? until right there. Anyway. What it does, let me get out of this water. So basically, instead of having them all funnel down to one side of the spawner room and then having them go along and then over and up, this one pushes them towards the, it does push, instead of pushing them toward a canal on the side, it pushes them towards a canal that goes through the middle. And if we look, the water is flowing that way there, and it's flowing this way here. And I just want to try something like this. Since it looks like this water that's pouring onto the sides is actually holding up the water, I want to see what will happen like, if I take away this water. And then, say, place here. Oh, look at that. Okay, that's kind of cool. Damn. And then... Do that. I I'm not going to put this in for now, just because I'm going to be running through a lot. Now... Um, the part where we make the motivator. Thing. So I think we are gonna do the 22 buck drop, but to do that, I'm gonna drop them down the same tube. So that's basically the part that differs from from the design that I got this idea from. Okay, so here's. Well, we'll figure it out later. Like the actual drop height. But I think once we get them up to about maybe five blocks above there, I'm actually going to put them into the same tube, and then that'll be what lifts them up. So this just gets them away from the spotter faster. And now what we need to do is we need to get up there. So I am going to kind of sort of copy the uh, like, drawing room, 
except I'm not going to have a crusher. Okay, so we want to go over one, two, three, four blocks. substantial height about it. And then I will be hooking this up to the stairs. I'm just going to guess right here. Okay. Way too far. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. Let's see. the room is at. Where are we AFK and where are we coming? off camera. Okay. So here. I'm going to go all the way down. Yes, I can. Okay. So I'll do that. And then to see that the spawner is actually working. Okay. So let's go up here. And one, two, three. Okay, I'm actually just going to finish this off, this part off camera and I'll be back momentarily. Okay, I'm back. So this is the design. Basically, it's a viewing window down so we can see if the spawner is actually working. And this room's going to be a little bit bigger. Anyway, so I'm going to go do the tubes that go up, and I will come back when we get to the part where we bring them together 
or getting hype. Okay, guys, I'm back. Uh, I just ran the. I just finished the elevator, and I also got my depth strider shoes. Once again, that is D E P T H, not D E A T H. Okay, now we need to go down to. That worked. So 44 plus 22 equals 66. So that's where we're dropping them from. I'm hoping this will be a one-hit kill. If it's not, it's okay, but I'm really hoping it is. And so just real quick, we'll just take a look at how the thing works. So let's just pretend for a minute uh, that I'm a skeleton. And uh, water goes here. Okay, so pretend I'm a skeleton. So say I spawn here. I'm just sitting here holding my bow, looking around. Get pushed down. Go over here. And since I'm a mob, I'll go up. And I might move faster than some mobs because I have sh special shoes on. Okay, so I go up past the viewing window. Hold on, it's not, it's not completely set up, it's just mostly set up. That's bad. Okay, that part's not important right now. Alright, so I'm a mob, I'm getting pushed over. Up she daisy I go. Sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six. Swimming, I'm swimming, I'm swimming, I'm swimming, I'm swimming. And... Off we go. And we're out. Er, and then here is where the player will um, terminate our lives. If we were a skeleton. And, yeah. So I'm going to put in the last two pieces of water, and we'll test and see if this thing works. Perfect, there, and, okay, just going to go on through, no, 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 up, 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 here we go. Okay, block that off. Okay. It's all the way over to here. And they should drop down right there. And be one hit kills if that part worked. So I guess let's I'm gonna put on my normal shoes. Actually I'll keep those on. And we are gonna go turn on the spawn. I should probably, uh, close this up, shouldn't I? We're gonna have to get rid of the spawner access sign, although... I'm... Actually, I'll put in a door for spawner access later. Water in the middle is in? Yep. Okay. Hold on. Just, I'm just gonna leave it like this for now, so I can get out. And we'll see if she's actually working. Okay, let's get these torches out. One. No, no, no. I don't want to go down. Two. How did I miss that? Three. Five. Shoot me. Six. And wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Seven. 
Okay, now... Okay, we might have some problems with this platform letting light in, though. But it does look to be going pretty fast. Let's see, are they coming up? See if we can see one come up. Look, here he comes. There they go. Does the final one into one work? Yep, seems to work pretty well. And, last part we need to test. Yeah, okay, that might have just been that individual skeleton. I'm hoping not. Okay, let's get a few more and we'll see if they're all one hit kills. One hit. One hit. Two hits. Okay, let's get a few more. But basically, so you just AFK right here. It's just within range of the spawner. Let me get rid of that torch. Okay, so I guess I'm going to AFK here for a while, test some more, and I'll be right back. Okay, um, just while we're waiting here, one other th good thing about this, I'm not sure if I mentioned it, but apparently, because it's moving them away from the spawner faster, um, the spawner will actually spawn, like, it'll, the spawner itself will work better, because the mobs are getting moved away faster. Not very many here, but let's just see what we got. Two hit kill. 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 Okay. So I think they... Okay, this might be a really bad idea. What happens if we do that? Are they one hit kills then? Okay, that guy died. I don't, I don't think we can do that. Yeah, that... Oh wait, no. Okay. Yeah. I think we'll just keep the two hit kill guys. So, um... I guess I'm gonna work on this room a little bit, and I'll get back to you guys, and then that'll probably be it for this episode. Okay, so I got the room a little more done. I'm gonna put the enchantment area over here. Um, maybe have one of those little really center things. I did a couple back near the beginning. Okay. Actually, I don't know what it is. But one of those like silly center things, the trapping and stuff. And maybe put one of those right. Here. And then have storage here, and this will be the exit. So I have it actually hooked up to the stairs now. So this runs all the way to the stairs. Uh, it also runs past the tunnel that me and Pierre took when we first found the spawner. So kind of historical. I, I don't know. Anyway. But, yeah, this is all for today, so thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed the episode, and we will see you all again next time. Howdy ho.